Hey everybody, I'm Jeff Baker and welcome to This Is What I'm Talking About. Today I'm talking about pizza. And this is going to be a pizza I think the likes of which you've never seen. But I think you're really going to like it. The inspiration for this one came from one of the uh, local guys here on a local channel 4 in San Diego called Sam the Cooking Guy. He has a cooking show once a week and uh, got a viewer call in or a viewer write in uh, one day and this is one of the viewer's recipes. This is totally different from anything you've ever seen, I'm pretty sure. So just bear with me. We're starting with, yeah, you see it right. This is sour cream. Sour cream on a pizza? I know. I'm using one of these preformed pizza doughs. This particular one is Mama Mary's. You can get uh, bubbly, you can get all kinds of different ones. I've never actually tried this particular one before, so we'll see how it goes. Like I say, we're starting with a sour cream base. And it didn't really say how much to put on there, but this is going to be, the sour cream is in place of the pizza sauce or red sauce or whatever you normally have on your pizza. So I'm just going to put what I would normally put on red sauce with sour cream. And his original, I'm changing his recipe a little bit, of course I always do, but his original recipe called for the sour cream, also called for salt, which we're doing. A little bit of salt. It also called for onions, so I sliced up some white onions here. Gonna put it on. This is going to be a real short, short video also. I've got one going in the grill here, so hopefully I haven't looked at it, so I have no idea what it's going to look like. We'll see. This normally you'd be doing in an oven, but it's so beautiful out here in San Diego today, I couldn't stay inside. It's about almost 80 degrees right now. Just gorgeous. Bright sunshine. Okay, he's had that, and he also had bacon on his, and that was it. Now, I'm not going to do bacon. I'm going to put some mushrooms on, only because I love mushrooms. And also, instead of the bacon, I'm going to substitute beef jerky saying what are you talking about well I found a source for the best beef jerky that I've ever tasted it's called jerky direct and yes I am a reseller for jerky direct so I'll be plugging it and I'll probably be using it on a lot of my recipes in the future this is called jerky direct this particular one I'm using um, the teriyaki flavored buffalo beef jerky it's it's a great I'm telling you it's a great jerky to use you want to visit my website is bakersgiftworld.jerkydirect.com. I'm telling you. Now we're putting on the jerky after the mushrooms. I just cut up some of the jerky. Like I said, this is a teriyaki flavor and it's, it is delicious. I've just, now that I'm thinking about the jerky, I've got a, I've got an egg breakfast recipe that I'm going to try this in. That's going to be awesome also. Like I say, bakersgiftworld.jerkydirect.com. Take a look at it. There's over 40 varieties of beef jerky. That'll be enough of my plugs for today. And that's it. We'll see what happens here. We've got one going here already. No cheese, no anything. So without cheese, it's kind of hard to, to uh, tell exactly when it's going to be done. His, re his recipe called for oven at 450 for about anywhere from 8 to 12 minutes depending on depending on your oven. So it said on the pizza dough, don't have to use a pan, so I just stuck it right on the grill. And it's been in there for about 12 minutes. So we're gonna see what we got here. I said, I don't know exactly what this is supposed to look like. Put the other one in. I don't know what it's supposed to look like, but I think it's looking pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty crusty on the bottom, so I think we're good. Cut this baby a little bit here. off a slice. 
the bottom crust crisped up pretty good, so I guess maybe this is going to be all right. If you look at what this pizza looks like here, not sure if you can see this and get a really good picture of it or not. Folks, I need some more of your recipe ideas. Come on, give me some ideas. Let me let me work on them. Oh well, yeah, that crisped up really nice on the bottom. Who would have thunk? Sour cream on a pizza. Onions, mushroom, and jerky. With the sour cream. That's freaking awesome. Oh, well, there you go. That's really better than I was expecting because I hadn't tried this before, so I had no idea what to expect. Sour cream on a pizza, the, the mental image is just like, what are you talking about? But trust me, it's really, really good. So folks, like I say, send me some more recipe ideas. Let me put my spin on. Let me say, I changed this one a little bit, but I think, it's, I think it worked out just fine. Now, when you serve pizza, you can tell your friends and neighbors, les c'est les bon temps, roulez, let the good times roll. And that's what I'm talking about.